We've been actually doing nothing. As you can tell, Emily is sitting on the couch with her heating pad, and I don't know how many candies she needs. We have toys everywhere, wrappers, trash, candy. It's literally an entire mess. And then we also, we've been procrastinating. Pro pro procrastinating? We've been procrastinating on putting all of these clothes away. We have two baskets right here, and then we have two trash cans right there. Trash cans? Two trash bags right there. We have this basket right here. There's a lot of clothes we have to fold. We, we literally haven't fold these in like three days. That's kind of sad, Emily. Are you okay? Hello? You having a sugar crash? I think she's having a sugar crash. You got a lot of sugar. <laughs> Same with Mel. Mel's been slacking too. So the whole house is slacking off. <laughs> Guys, look at how clean the house looks like now. I used a lint roller for the couch and this is the first time I used it and honestly, it made such a big difference rather than using like a vacuum and I absolutely love it. It's gonna be on my Amazon storefront under cleaning. The toys are away now. It looks so much more clean. You can see everything. The kitchen was also so dirty, not gonna lie. Like the most dirtiest part was this coffee area. There was just like a lot of breadcrumbs. So we just cleaned that up and vacuumed the floors. Also, here's the little new addition to the house. We got some new home decor. We installed these shelves and then I added some decor, but I do want to go shopping for more because I don't really have anything. And then I also added this chair from Walmart and it's literally my favorite chair ever. It came with these pillows and I love this texture. It's so pretty. And I added like a flower vase right here. Probably doesn't match, but I thought I would add a little bit of more color. I also got this from Home Goods, and it's like a little storage basket that has a lid on top, which is super cool. And then I also added this lamp that I got from Target, which I'm upset and I think it makes us so cozy, especially at night. Oh, and we also added these frames. Well, Caleb added them. I keep saying we, but he's the one that added them. I got them from Home Goods, and they are so cute. It makes the entrance look so much better, like when you walk in, especially with those shelves over there. It just adds so much more color, and we love the wood type of vibe, so we try to like add more of that. And these are our wedding pictures. Here's the one in our room. We are gonna add more, but this one kind of like broke down. That's why there's none right here. It fell on the floor, and like the side part broke. But we just decided that we're gonna add like another row because it looks very awesome. Awkward, especially when the doors close. But yeah, that's pretty much for our room. I'm getting a new dresser next month in April So I'm really excited because this one broke and it just does not look cute I feel like it's too much white and the one that I got is beige and it's gonna look so cute and look at Winnie She's growing so much. Winnie come here. Winnie here. Hi. She hiding in the vlog. She hiding in the vlog. Okay, I'm gonna get ready now because we're gonna go out and actually do something with our lives Because we've been at home all day, but yesterday we were out all day That's why we we're kind of like just having a slow day, but we're gonna go out and do something super exciting and fun that we did yesterday we're gonna do it again because why not anyways Caleb's already ready I'm still wearing like PJs so I'm gonna get ready So guys, we made it to CarMax. We're gonna be looking at a bunch of cars. She wants an SUV, I want a small car, but honestly, I could go for it with it. So we're gonna look at them. I like the Hyundai Elantra 2023. It looks really nice. Which one do you like, the Genesis? I don't know what I like, honestly. I'm just looking around. I think she wants the Genesis, and she doesn't know exactly the right, like the exact model, but let us know for her, because she's kind of confused on what model's the best to get for Genesis, and if they're really good. Not really just Genesis. Like I like Range Rovers, but they break down. I like I like the Kia, which a lot of people hate, but now they rebranded their whole thing, and now I really like it, and it's just like for future cars, if I want to be a mom one day. Maybe there's a car you guys like in the video, so let us know what car you like when we're going through each car and like the interior exterior I actually just sold
own my car for two thousand dollars i bought it for seven thousand in 2021 after three years the value of my car literally is two thousand dollars which is insane to think about but i sold that car that was the first car that we ever met in a big piece of memory for us and i'm gonna be selling my car too which is the mustang i just don't think it's reliable and i just want a bigger car because this is just very small especially with like what we're planning in the future which is not soon but i also want to get the hang of having an suv this car is so just too expensive for me and insurance is so high just because it is a gt and it's so fast plus we have a golden retriever that's going to be massive yeah, so, so we're going to need a bigger car we need at least one big car for me right now i don't really care about what car i get i just want an suv that's good that's not going to break down guys i've been talking about this jeep gladiator for so long now it's pretty pricey but this car is nice but it's so wait why does it sound like that this looks so good in the video see that's what i'm saying look at it my car is so tiny i hate oh like vlogging in my car this yeah drive cute. manual and the top the whole thing comes off it's forty-seven thousand. This is so nice. Isn't it? So this comes off. The whole thing. So nice. This whole top comes off. I'm not a huge fan of Jeeps, but this one's really nice. Emily loves Range Rovers. Do Range Rovers break down? That's the question. People say that it breaks down so easily. Some people say it doesn't at all. Some people say they love it. Some people say they hate it. What do you Holy think cow. about it? 50K. I can see you in this BMW. I like the interior. These doors are so heavy. Bro, struggling. <laughs> wow. Oh, this is nice. I like this car. Look how cute. Like, I love the white interior, but I know I'd probably get it messed up, so I'd probably have to pay extra to do, like, the stain resistant. I guess when you drive in this car, this whole top opens, too. So, we just got home, and I kind of have this little setup for me and Emily. We've been all over the place today. I got it all set up for us to watch a movie. Just ordered pizza as well, so that's gonna come. We got into comfy clothes. We're about to watch a movie, and honestly, I would say we got really out of a slump because we definitely did a lot, and I feel so exhausted now, and obviously, we can't do really do much because it's 9 p.m. so we just decided to like watch a movie since we haven't watched a movie in a while ordered pizza which i'm really really excited to eat because we haven't ate in a while it doesn't even feel like we were lazy today like it feels like, uh, like it feels like we woke up early got a bunch of stuff done the amount of stuff we did we were out all day pretty much for the rest of the day like, yeah and slump. we definitely want to post more on this channel and change up like our content maybe do like some traveling videos we really want to travel a lot our dream is to travel a lot and and post more on this Probably channel like a little kid <laughs> i think the main reason why it's so hard to like post on this channel as much is because i get really confused with like my type of content on my youtube channel and content on this channel since it's like couples channel yeah so it's like a whole different niche we're thinking about doing more of vlog style and how i do on my channel where we just like do some cleaning videos but we also do like some challenging videos stuff different like that because i feel like i love watching like couples doing sunday reset routine together but i also like watching challenges like i know most of you guys are probably like watching challenges but we just need suggestions on like what we could do i got cheese pizza when he smells it <laughs> i always get 10 inch and i got the comment below if you have pineapple on your pizzas it's so underrated like if you haven't had pineapple with chicken and barbecue sauce so good What do you think? Is this your like number one car brand? Not really. I mean, I don't really have a favorite. I just am trying to learn more about all the ones that I like. But like, I don't have a favorite. These look nice. The white interior. This is what I'm talking How much? $75,000. Holy <laughs> Point for 14. Wait, oh, yeah, act like you're like you're talking in your video. Hey guys. <laughs> no, baby, look how good it looks. It does look. It looks good. good. Yeah, I think so. I don't know. <laughs> Thanks for a TV. I don't know what that is actually. Comment below. What is that? Ninja. <laughs> Mills a ninja, Winnie. You gotta learn that.